Well, before I get into this video, I just wanted to show you something here. I came outside to have a cup of coffee. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning here in Sacramento. And I just happened to look up at the sky and seen that it was blue. Now that's something I don't see. I don't see that very often anymore. So I had to take a couple of pictures of it just to just to show somebody that hasn't seen a blue sky in a long time that this is what they look like. Usually when I come out here and look up, all I see is a bunch of white trails and silver sky and it's usually just a mess. But it's so beautiful this morning, I just thought I'd take a couple of pictures and put them up there. Well, I ran across a video here the other day from a group on my Facebook page. The video showed up. The group's name is Mars Alive. And they got a picture here showing uh, the possibility of a bug being on the Curiosity rover. And in their video, I'll give them credit for the find. I don't know if they found it or not, but I'm going to give them credit at this point. They show what could possibly be a bug that has ended up in the uh, dust sample collection on the Curiosity rover. Well, after looking at the picture that they used in their video, I tend to agree with them. So what I did is I went to NASA's website and I downloaded the photo myself. And I downloaded a couple of other photos along with it that, uh, that's a minute or two or three minutes later. Just to see if, uh, if the bug was still there or did it move around or whatever. And before we go too much farther, I guess I ought to show you the area where this, this alleged bug is at here. And uh, there are some moving parts right here in this area. But the part where the bug is, is stationary. And I guess the reason I'm pointing this out is because later on, the bug does not seem to be in that uh canister anymore and so i just wanted to make sure that it wasn't tossed out by the movement of the of the uh equipment going there so if it if it left it left on its own accord i would i would figure so i started looking around at some of the other photos taken at the approximately the same time and here's one that's taken about a minute later and you can't really see all the way into the little canister there because of the way the rover arms tilted or the cameras tilted but i found another photo here taken approximately an hour later that shows maybe it's gone but then again if you look up in the corner there's something up there and that could be just some dirt or it, i don't know it's hard to tell i'll leave that one up to you but then i got to looking around at all the pictures i thought i'd just try to find that bug in all the pictures it was taken and so i did find this and you can use your own judgment here, but I'm telling you what, it looks like a looks like it might be a bug that's trying to climb up into the rover there. You can see his little legs, and I don't know. Anyway, that's all I got on this bug. Well, before I go, I would like to tell you that you might want to, if you're into Mars anomalies and stuff like that, you're... You might want to check out Mars Alive. I'm going to leave a link to their YouTube videos. Uh, they have a, a face, like I said, they've got a Facebook group going to. You can probably get the link to that from from their uh, YouTube channel. But they they get some interesting stuff on there a lot of times, so you might want to check them out. Anyway, have a good day.